Hi everyone, this is Sumit here and welcome to my channel Excel with Sumit. In this video, I'll explain two methods of identifying duplicates in a column. In the first method, I'll explain how to do that using conditional formatting and in the second method, I'll explain how to do that using counter function. So let's start with the first method. In the first method to identify duplicates in a column, you need to first select the entire column here and then go to home, go to conditional formatting, go to highlight sales rules and then go to this option called duplicate values. As soon as you click this option, you get a dialog box where it will ask you to color the cell with specific color which are duplicates. So here by default, it will select the light red color. So if you press OK here, we see that the duplicates values are colored. For example, here apple is colored because it is repeated twice and mango is colored because it is repeated thrice. So in the first method, within a few clicks, you'll be able to identify the duplicates value within a column. In the second method, what you need to do is add extra column after the column where you need to find a duplicate. Write a function called count ifs or count if. So we'll write is equal to coun. Then we'll use the arrow key and go down. And then as soon as we reach count if, we'll press tab here. Now we'll select the entire cell here for which we need to find the duplicate. Now press a four key here, press comma, and then we'll select the first cell here and then press enter. Now, when we drag down the formula till the bottom, we get the value 1, 2, 3 based on the repetition of the value. So whatever is 1 here, it means the number or text is not repeated here. And whatever is 2, it means the number or text is repeated twice. And similarly, wherever it is 3, it means that the number or text is repeated 3 times here. So now if you see here, apple has twice because apple is repeated twice here. And then we have mango thrice because mango is repeated three times here. In this way, you can calculate duplicates in a column by using two methods.